guys, it's Flora on another Friday with Flora, and today I am doing a video called Middle School Stereotypes. As I have said in previous video, I'm going into middle school soon, and um, I just thought I would do some of the middle school stereotypes for you guys. Please don't be offended by any of these. These are stereotypes. Like Usually people are a mix of these things, and I just hope that none of you guys are offended. This is for entertainment purposes only. Okay, so first we have the cheerleader, and the cheerleader, in some cases, they're all snotty, and they're all think that they're just so much better than you, but in some movies, they're all peppy, usually a little bit ditzy, um, so I am doing kind of a mix. They're a little bit snotty, a little bit self-obsessed, but also very optimistic and peppy at the same time, so here is my interpretation of a cheerleader stereotype. Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? Me! Uh, this is going to be so awesome. Cartwheel! Laura! Cartwheel! Misty! Somersault! Cheerleaders! And we're back! I know these gorgeous silver earrings that go great with your hair. And they're all sparkly, just like your nails. <gasps> oh, a munchie! You are adorable. Let's do your hair. And we can do your makeup. Or we can do a group hug. <gasps> group hug, that's perfect. Because they love us. Next, we have the goth or the emo or the loner who just prefer to be by themselves and are a little bit on the dark side. They just kind of do whatever creepy things they do. I'm a goth. I like the color black. My eyeshadow is black. Oh look, this chair I'm sitting in, it's black. Oh, cool. A book, it's black. And it has dust on it. <laughs> oh, cool. It's a grim book about death and stuff. Go away. Now we have the cool people, and after that we have the popular people, and they are very different because, of course, popular people are cool, but the cool people are just like, they're totally chill, they have all the swag, they're just like, you just feel like a loser in front of them. Sort of. <laughs> Not necessarily. And then the popular people, you're more like intimidated by them because they're just so popular. Hi, I'm Flora. Sup? I really like your motorcycle. <laughs> Thanks. I, um, I like other stuff, too. Oh yeah, um, I like puppies and lemonade. And I like to sleep. Cool. Later. <sighs> Dang it. <sighs> yeah. Oh, hey, Stacy. Want to go to the mall after school? I heard that Megan's has a lip gloss sale. Um, excuse me? Who are you? Oh, wait. I don't care. <laughs> You're still here? Uh, well, I'm looking for the music room. The music room. So, could you tell me where it is? 
And you're asking me where the music room is. Yes. Do you know who I am? Okay, well, you go down that hallway, you take a left, and then, oh, wait, I'm popular, you're not, so I don't care. Scram! How do I look? Fabulous. I know, right? I always look fabulous. Okay, so, here's the deal. What looks better? Mature purple or sparkles? Sparkles. Avi. So anyway, did you see what Olivia was wearing today? Yeah. No more essent orange. That's so insane, isn't it? Nobody wears orange anymore. Especially that weird neon light color. Yeah. Oh, I heard that Brooke and Ken broke up. Okay, so here are the nerds or geeks. There are two different types of nerds, and one is the kind that is like shy, keeps them themselves, but they're still super smart. And then the other is the kind that is also smart, but they like to tell everybody everything that they know. So they're kind of the babblers. <laughs> Three plus one hundred. One hundred and three. Why is the water blue? Because of the light that bounces off it. Where's here? The U.S. What? Um, nothing. I didn't say anything. She's weird. Yeah, what is she? What is she reading? I'm reading the best book ever. Yeah, whatever. Of their diamonds. Actually, yeah, look, right here. This book is all about gems and minerals from all over the globe. Yeah, whatever. I just care about it all around my finger. Oh, well, I guess diamonds are pretty amazing how they're all, the pressure it is applied to make them appear and, you know, all that stuff. But these gems are so, so they're beautiful. all ugly. Like, that's beautiful and that's beautiful. But everything else is ugly. Actually, I beg to differ. They're all so different in their shapes and sizes. Maybe they're not what you think is pretty, but I think that they're all gorgeous. Their colors and shapes and sizes, they're all just so unique. Yeah, whatever. I'm moving. Oh, okay. Oh, hmm. Where's that one from? Next, I have the drama queens that over-exaggerate everything and make everything a big deal, even though it really isn't. They're such bullies. Why do they have to be like that? Hmm. Ah! My ears! Oh, the sound! It's deafening! Ah! Oh! Oh my gosh, my poor, poor ears. I'm gonna be deaf. Oh, that was terrible. That door was so loud, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Yeah. Speak louder. I can barely hear you. I must be deaf or something. <sighs> it must be that stupid door. I like your hair. Only my hair? That's it? What about my dress or my ring or my gorgeous face? That is so rude. You think you can come up here and be so rude and obnoxious? You're such a little brat. So Only my hair. <sighs> yeah, so obviously she needs to take a chill pill. And last but not least, we have the jocks or the athletic people. And they are just always trying to stay fit. the end of my video i really hope you guys enjoyed that and that none of you were offended and 
Um, in the in the comments below, you guys can tell me what you guys think you're most like or what you guys thought was the funniest of all of these stereotypes. And yeah, I will see you guys next Friday. Bye!